Well, do you remember the original idea or impetus that led you to writing the Never Game? Um, well, there were a couple of um, ideas. I guess the first one that occurred to me was um, a few years ago. Now, I'm not a video gamer. I'll, I'll admit that right up front. What, the, the Never Game is filled with a lot of... A lot of material about uh, video games that I uh, I researched, and it's talked to experts, and it's uh, you know it's it's all accurate. But what was one of the inspirations for the game was uh, about three or well, maybe three years ago. I was uh, visiting my uh, my family, and my nine year old niece said, "Uncle Jeff, let's play a video game." I said I was game for it, so to speak, but didn't really know. Um, anything about them so she took my smartphone loaded the game on and she had her smartphone we were connected via wi-fi so it was a game we were going to play together and she said are you ready and i said yeah but i don't really know how to play she said like this and she took out a sword and stabbed me to death my avatar of course <laughs> in in it was like 10 seconds <clears throat> And I, I didn't, frankly, think it was all that sporting of her because I never knew the game, uh, never played it before. So, we, but we laughed about it, and she taught me how to how to play some. But it gave me the idea of, well, what if somebody became obsessed with a video game and uh, tried to take the fictional game, the fantasy game, into real life? And that's where the uh, the story came about. Great. 